This is a GE Profile clothes dryer and the problem is that the drum rollers are sticking and when you turn the machine on the drum will turn for a few turns and then it stops. So this video shows how to replace the drum rollers. There the machine is running for a little bit and then it stops. That's because the drum rollers are sticking and the motor hums also at that time. Always make sure you have the machine unplugged before you start working with it. At first I thought it was the motor was bad but we took the belt off and the motor was running so I figured it's the drum rollers. There's four screws in the back of the console and you take those off. Then you lift the console up and then there's a couple screws under that that holds the top of the machine in place. So there you lift the lid up and then there's a couple of screws in the top of the front panel. Take those off. Then the four screws behind the dryer door that also have to come out. Now you disconnect the uh, cable to the lid switch, then set the door aside. Take the cover off over the blower wheel. You also want to check this for uh, lint collected inside and clean out any lint in the cover here and also in the ductwork inside the machine. We usually use a long handled brush to get into the ductwork and then use a vacuum cleaner to vacuum out the inside of the machine and check the blower wheel to make sure it's turning freely. Then you look under the drum here and you, in the back of the machine you can see the drum roller back there. So those have to replace plus two on the bulkhead. Now we take the bulkhead off, disconnect the cables there, and there's four screws to hold the bulkhead in place. Then remove the bulkhead, set it aside. And there's the rollers that are on the bulkhead. They have to be replaced. There's also two under the drum at the back of the machine that have to be replaced. So we have to take the drum out. And there are the belts on there. You slide the belt off. That's out. Then we want to put this guy back in. It's a new one. 
It's got a little cover over the threads. There we go. Then, got a washer on this side. And then this goes on there. And another washer. And then, the nut. Get it pretty snug. Okay. Same thing on the other one. So that's the bulkhead. Put the crescent on here. Try it from the front. Did it. it can be taken off from the front. Okay, let's go then. Okay, got it. Got it on there. Okay, back on that nut. Okay, I'm on the nut. Turn this thing tight. Okay, that should do it. Now, one more. Make sure we didn't knock any wires loose and then we have to vacuum it there. yeah I can see the light through there yep I can see the light through there so the duct has to be clear I can see down in there too yeah. I can see inside the duct there it's, it's clear Okay, here's a new belt. Okay, ridges to the inside, ridges against the drum. This is the front. Wrap this around. And the belt goes right there. I can see the lines. So this flips over. And this should slide in. Like so. There we go. And it slides back up to there. Right there. Like so. Do that to prop it up. Now the hard part, getting the belt on.